figure this is the safest of us out the blast radius. Whenever you want to see humanity's best hope for the future go up in smoke, just hit that button. over me. The heat, the force, the radiation, the fear. It's the end of the world all over again. I close my eyes. I see my life before all of this, before the bombs. Everything can change in an instant, and the future you plan for yourself shifts whether or not you're ready. At some point, it happens to all of us. This wasn't the world I wanted, but it was the one I found myself in. The Commonwealth. My home. Ripped apart and put back together. I thought, I hoped, I could find my family, cheat time, make us whole again. The way we were. Now I know. I know I can't go back. I know the world has changed. But the road ahead will be hard. This time, I'm ready. Because I know war. War never changes. Holy shit, that was one hell of a bang, wasn't it? So that's it. The Institute is destroyed. It's finally over. You did issue the evacuation order, right? I didn't notice in all the chaos. Yeah, we gave everyone a chance to get out. Good, I thought so. It was just watching that explosion. I just hope as many people as possible got out. I hate that we had to do that. But they left us no choice. It was war. But now, the war against the Institute is over. The way is now clear for the Commonwealth to finally come together and build something good for the future. But it's not all sunshine and rainbows from here on out. What, no sunshine and rainbows? Next, you're going to tell me I'm not getting a pony. <laughs> if I had any ponies to hand out, you'd be first on my list. We could never have gotten here without you, General. The Institute was the most insidious threat we've ever faced. They kept the Commonwealth divided for centuries. But there are plenty of other problems left to deal with. I don't think the Minutemen are going to be out of a job for a long time yet. As much as I might wish it. We deserve to enjoy our victory, but soon enough, it's going to be time to get back to work. Hi. General, I think it's time to deal with the Brotherhood. I agree, but it's going to be tough to fight their airship. That's for sure, but I think I may have a way to take it out. I've been talking to Sturgis about using an artillery strike against the Bridwin. The trick is, we need to target it from multiple directions to overwhelm their defenses. Sturgis figures that if we can attack from at least five different directions, we have a good chance of bringing it down. Once we have enough batteries set up, we can fire them all together at the airship. They won't have time to take evasive action. With any luck, that will be the end of the Brotherhood and the Commonwealth. 